our normal links, guys. I see. Now we're live. Hello, hello. Welcome to tonight, Wednesday, the 14th episode of Sugar Skull Sweeties. Yeah, why, why does Giggs have a reputation, guys? I want to know about this. I know. <gasps> Congratulations! <laughs> that is awesome. Congratulations, Clouder. That is awesome. We can't hear gigs. You actually guys cannot hear giggles talking. Rock, can you hear Rock and Gigg uh, Ava, uh, me and giggles? Duh. You can't hear you. You need to make a sound. Did you hear her? No? They cannot hear you. Rock said he cannot hear you. Hi, Jay. That is not awesome. <laughs> Usually they can't see me. A foot cleavage? <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, yeah. A foot of cleavage I was. I know why. Because I made it myself on XSplit. I'm wearing the same shirt. Okay, is that better? Can you hear me now? Can you hear her now, guys? Is that too loud? I forgot I had um, made it myself on XSplit the other night when I played music. Ah, okay, anti, it was not a foot of cleavage, and I've got the same shirt on now that I had earlier. See? Boobies! Okay, how long are we going to stare and stare at your boobs? <laughs> I'm moving it now. <laughs> <laughs> Those like, are some nice boobs. You scared oh, rock, rock left left the room. <laughs> you scared rock off. <laughs> Boobies! Man, Simon Cowell, welcome to the room. <laughs> <laughs> Baby shot. Yes, rock left because I was showing everybody my boobs. What is everybody vaping on? I am actually vaping a strawberry lust by Savage Juice. It is freaking awesome. I'm loving it. I am doing oh fairy fairy fuel by Savage. I am halfway through the bottle and I just got this what two days ago? A day ago. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, noob. If you like them. If you like <laughs> boobs, go like them on Facebook. <laughs> I have a feeling someone just got a screen capture. <laughs> that is it tastes like funny. strawberries. <laughs> you know, Texas, every time I talk to you or every time I see you, you are eating something. I don't know how you do not weigh 300 pounds. He's fucking tiny. Excuse my language. He is I tiny. Know. And he eats all the time. That's all he does. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Thanks, noob. 
Savage juice is good. I mean, this is full of flavor. And usually I'm weird about my, um, I'm, I'm weird about my strawberries because sometimes they don't taste right, but this is amazing. Oh, we're the booby sisters. Who? That's nice. Me and you. Sister Creepy says I we're the booby sisters. Have, no, my boobs do not compare to that. Strawberries. <laughs> Strawberries. So, you guys, oh, oh my Lord, god, do you want to hear what we have tonight? Do you want to know what we got going on tonight? It got a little chilly in here. Oh my god, like all of a sudden I just got like a freaking... NCB. Sorry, sister, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Do y'all... NC booby challenge? Mine are bigger. Yeah, that's a given. I have the biggest on the channel until well, I stand next to Risa, I guess. So, <laughs> we have a special guest coming on tonight. In about Yay. 15 minutes. Uh-huh. Because he was um, MIA um, last Monday. So, yeah, we're going to do it today. Yes, I am married. But I'm not vape married. <laughs> oh, her hubby is my perv. He perves me during yes. it. He's my perv texter during the day. Yes, I cut my hair. I chopped it. I'm kind of regretting it right now, but I did. I chopped it off. I was told today my hair looked beautiful. I was like, I wear it down quite a bit. And they're like, it's so long. I'm like, Cause we so see it, irritating. We see it up all the time. Well, hey, you know what? It takes me like five minutes to do my hair in the in the mornings now. I love it, love it. So oh, those of I'm only married for now, Rock. <laughs> so those of y'all who live in Texas or plans on um, being in the Texas area, look, we got a new vape shop. And it's so cute. I love the name. It's called Vape Escapes. But it's so Oh, cute. with an X instead of a C. Yeah. Giggles went to the chop shop for her. Yes. I did. You're pretty sure no one noticed on CF show that I had boobs? Or my hair. <laughs> yeah, she got all dolled up probably for his show. He didn't. She doesn't get dolled no, up. No, I him. actually, I actually didn't put my makeup on until before I contacted you because I was gonna take my sexy pictures. She had to do so a sexy selfies like like I do. Vision requested that we have the hotties of Nuke. Cute. I like the name. Oh, hell, I'm getting, like, very, very... No, I'm not sending it to his email. I'm keeping it. Rack's over here getting upset that the Hatties and Nuke aren't sending their pictures to him. <laughs> uh oh wait a minute, what? Ask Rock what he receives sometimes through a text message. What do you receive sometimes through a text message, Rock? Boob shots. No comment. Yeah, okay. So I can send boob shots too then. Okay. <laughs> Wait a minute. He's getting boob shots of you and you can't send me boob shots? What the hell is up with that? He does not figure that out. And he, he's not getting boob shots from me. He, he just, he's not, oh my god, he's not getting boob shots from me. He's getting... Is he getting the undies? So, oh, hey, Professor. 
<laughs> she changes the conversation. <laughs> hey, Professor B. Vapen, put your link in love. You guys, go check him out. He's a juice, um, whatchamacallit, a juice Bender. reviewer. Reviewer. Oh, reviewer. And he's actually got a contest going on on his page. Woo So go like, go be friends, Ooh. you know. Where's my boob shots? Racism, pure and simple. Yeah, I have really gigs. What the fuck? I am not sending him my boobs, okay? And the giggle bot is out of the gate. Who is Simon? Simon Cowell, who are you? <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> who is Simon? South of the border? No, I'm not. Okay, I'm not sending him any nudie nudie pictures like that. Professor, put, put in your link, babe, to Facebook. Because, you know, I'm just going to let you. He is the caddy guy. Because we're the host and we said so. <laughs> from that one dumb show. Oh my god, okay, I know who it is now. Because he fucking just texted me. Who is it? <laughs> Smart ass. No, he does not get boob shots, you guys. Like, for real. No, oh, I'm wrong. That's not him. Are you oh, wait, what? Okay, maybe that's not him. Who is, who is, what is the name? Who's Simon. You guys, there's Simon Cowell. There's his Facebook page. Go and like him. Go and love him. Go and check out. He's got like an awesome, awesome, awesome thing in my bobber going on. Giveaway. Who is Simon Cow Cow Cowell? No, I do not want to play the creeper guessing game every day now. Like, it starts to become, like, really old. And I don't have time to guess. Really, now, just breathe, why don't you? Just breathe. Sorry. Take those. Getting all worked up. So do I, I don't have... That's not our guest. Um, noob. Noobers, that's not our guest. It's just a new shop that's opening up, correct? Giggles, Vape, es uh, vape Escape? Yes, Vape Escape is the new shop. What? What, what, what? Stay away from the vans without windows, gigs. Are you banned? Boom, done, I win. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Did gonna you ban Simon Cowell? I'm gonna start banning people that want to play creeper games. Go ahead. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um there's no picture. Simon, uh, if you don't want to get banned, I would suggest, my dear, that you um <laughs> let somebody know who you are for reals. I'm trying to think if that Simon, are you from, um, Austin? Is the video messing up, guys? Vaughn is having issues right now. No. Simon, where are you okay, from? Okay, Simon, you need to tell someone who you are. Hit up one of the mods and tell them who you really are. Go figure, we get the giggles one under control and then this shit happens. I know, right? Okay. So. In about two minutes, we will invite um, our special guest. Uh, ha, 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 ha. Are you excited? <laughs> Is that your evil laugh? Yeah, I've actually <laughs> seen a picture of him, but I've never actually talked to him. So it'll be nice, and we can get clarification on the name. Look. Ha, 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 ha. 
ha I am going to eat your brains. <laughs> your bathy drip tip. Oh, Lord have mercy. Your hubby is drilling holes for you as long as he's not drilling in you. Well, that might be a good thing, too. Though. Well, some of us might like that. <laughs> <laughs> Simon, check your IMs. Then you have an IM. Right. You'd starve at your house. Why would I starve? Oh, because I don't have no brains. That's not nice. Well, if she's a zombie, she can't eat her own damn brains. True that. True that. Just so uh -oh. but she does have the roommate. Simon, sweetie, if you don't answer an IM, you're going to be banned. And it and it bans your IP address. It doesn't just ban your name. So somebody better IM one of these mods, like, quick. Because then we're going to have to go through a whole big thing, and you're going to have to email me, and then I'm going to have to figure out who you are to unban you, and it's a whole long, big process. Please, I am somebody. Oh, Professor, now you, um, now you understand why I picked that one. <laughs> Your time's what, up. Your... What did you order from him? I'm not, I can't tell you that. Oh, he answered SVC, so don't ban him. No. Oh. No, um, no, say, uh, Jay answered SVC. Did you get an answer from him, Rock? Nope. Okay, Simon, you have exactly five seconds, and I will do the countdown until you are banned, unless you answer rocks. I am. Five, four, three, two, one. You're banned. That sucks. That sucks. Hello. Hello, hello. Hey, hey. Oh, meet your room, love. Hello. Hello, hello. Did you meet? Hello. Wait, no, you gotta meet hello. your room. <laughs> For guest on. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I beat it. Oh, and look, he changed clothes. He's not blending into the wall anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! You can see me now. No, you don't understand. He was wearing camouflage, and it was so funny because I said, "You know, I'm lucky I could see you." And and his wonderful wife in the background. <laughs> he goes, "Wait, what?" His wonderful wife in the background goes, "Cause you're wearing camouflage." <laughs> <laughs> he was wearing oh, Okay, that was funnier when it was done. <laughs> yeah, I guess they had to see it. Damn it. I did not cloud I did not change my room around. I actually went to a different room. So this is N New Orleans Saints J, right? I even though I call him No Saints J. No, New Orleans Saints. I see. Hence the big Houdat Nation flag behind me, like that. Hey, turn that cam just a little, so that way we can see the pretty wifey. Shh. Shh. Oh wait, she goes running. <laughs> she went running. <laughs> She is very camera shy. I am not coming back in there. Yes, you are. Because she's in chat, is she not? What was her name? She's the... Oh, Saints um, Vapor. Saints Vapor, right? Yeah, Saints Vapor. Saints Vapor! Saints Vapor! Can she hear me? 
She can hear you. She's like peeking around the corner here. She bolted. <laughs> she was a blow. Yeah, no kidding. She did. You know, this show is recorded, so we can watch that in slow mo as much as we want. <laughs> there you go. There, see. <laughs> Change her name to Flash Vapor. <laughs> okay, it's Cloud Surfer. So, Mr. J, tell us about you. Yes. Tell us why you started vaping, when you started vaping, why did you start vaping, just because. And we won't, we won't pick um, on you, Saints. We won't pick on you. Come and join us. You don't have to be on cam. We'll be nice. Oh, we. <laughs> <laughs> if you watch, she'll dart by real quick again. <laughs> no one wants to see that. <laughs> um, you know, tomorrow actually makes my three-year vapor vapor anniversary. I guess. Congrats! I Congratulations! Yeah. Um, That's awesome. I, uh, I actually started smoking very young. I grew up in a really rough household, and. I can remember being six years old and going to the store for my mom and dad buying cigarettes. They were like 70 cents a pack. Um, and I started actually smoking when I was 13. Um, and then smoking with my parents' consent when I was 14. Uh, so I had been smoking for a long time. And uh, about four years ago, had my first heart attack um, at the age of 40. Um, my mom actually had died at 42 of a heart attack and my grandfather at 48. So I had a really, uh, bad family history with it. So I should have known better, but I didn't. Um, but at, even having the first heart attack wasn't enough to make me quit. So, uh, kept smoking and, uh, had my second heart attack. Um, about two years ago Saint on St. Saint, Saint Patrick's Day. Um, so uh, I had a, I was working uh, at a company that was doing blasting at the time, and I was involved in all these chemicals and all that stuff and just developed this really nasty cough. And it just so happened one of the guys I was working with uh, was using uh, from Volcano the magma cigarettes. I don't know if anybody's familiar with them. They're like a cigarette. Cigalite, but they had a little tank on them that you could fill up that takes like not even a quarter mil of juice in it um, So he gave me his and I started using that and uh, <clears throat> Used that probably for about six months and it was the messiest damn thing I've ever dealt with they all leaked they got all over the place <laughs> um, But I stuck it out and I, I refused to start smoking again and then I ended up getting uh, the original lava tube from volcano and uh, using that and uh, that helped a little bit better um, and like like an idiot I never even thought about going online and checking out the vaping community I just continued to try and do this all on my own I live in a rural area there's no vape shops around um, for the longest time the only juices I got were from Mount Baker vapor and not slamming them you know Um, and the first time that somebody gave me what you know he would consider a higher end juice, I was blown away by how great it tasted. And I started uh, checking out uh, stuff online and, and ended up finding the vaping community. And that has been like a second coming for me um, as far as uh, sticking it out and, and learning some new stuff. I just started getting into rebuildables. Um, just got my first uh, mechanical mod here uh, not too long ago and followed it up with the second with the Hades. Um, and, you know, honestly, <clears throat> shows like this and the Facebook pages and the web pages have just been a huge help in, in keeping me going and making me glad that I've done this. And it also has allowed me to uh, turn some other people onto it, which is an awesome awesome thing to do you know um, when you get somebody who is a smoker and you can turn them on to vaping and they stick with it that's a great feeling to have um, I've, I've been fortunate enough that I've got two friends now that have been vaping for 
one of them's been vaping now for nine months and the other one for about six months that I helped both of them get both of them started. So, um, and you just missed it, but the missus went by. <laughs> did she crawl? Um, did she really crawl? She, she crawled. She sure did. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I know. She is like, so if you go on to her Facebook page, you see all these pictures. My wife's a beautiful woman. She takes all these great pictures. But don't get her on a camera. Whatever. She has to take the picture. Well, she could come and take the picture here. All she has to do is smile. <laughs> she, she said next time. We'll definitely have to get her on. Oh my gosh. You know, it's kind of funny because it's almost like we're alcohol is anonymous, but we're vapors anonymous, but we're really vapors. Um, not non anonymous. I don't know what the opposite word is for anonymous. Um, so it's well, like it's smokers the, anonymous. Yeah. Oh, it's they, vapors anonymous without the anonymous part. Uh, <laughs> the unanon the anonymous. I don't know what the opposite the word. Anonymity. Is. The, <laughs> but it's kind of cool. So how long have you been like on Vapors TV and checking out the channels and? All that good stuff. Um, probably right about the time you started your show because I, I remember the, the first time I came in, it was your second broadcast. For so, which show? How long have you been on? For Vaping uh, Bunnies? Your show, whichever what your first show on here. Vapor, vaping Bunnies, which started in February. Okay, so so since February, I've been on, on, uh, on Vapors TV. Um, before that, you know, a couple of the Facebook pages and, and a couple other things online. Um, so, like I said, it's been the whole internet thing. I don't I don't know why I never looked into it before, but relatively new as far as the vaping thing goes for me, um, which is amazing because I'm on the internet 23 out of 24 hours a day. So, mm -hmm. uh, just never thought to look it up. That's funny. Well, and that you know the thing is is I. Vapors and Anonymous. Yes, that's the name of our show. Um, yes. <laughs> um, the thing about it is, is I started vaping in December, and I got introduced to Vapors TV in January. Well, a little before January, maybe. And then I started broadcasting in February. February. And ever since then, shut up, I know I can't say that word. Um, ever since then, it's just become an addiction, you know, and it's so wonderful to hear other people's stories and find out what's going on and the newest mod and the biggest clouds and I'm actually learning to blow. I'm so happy. So happy. See, I, you know, the, the cloud blowing thing still has me mystified. I, I'm not sure what the whole seduction is with that um I, I i vape for the flavor and um that's you know I, I stay away from the tobacco flavors just because i don't want to go back to smoking um so i i do a lot of the fruit or dessert flavors or, or, or stuff like that um so i i am just baffled by the whole big cloud thing because i don't know that you get that type of flavor through it and you may i don't know i haven't tried it and all, um with the cloud blowing well you know when you drip, you get the you get the flavor, and it intense is intense flavor, freaking yeah. delicious. And the clouds are kind of like that extra little orgasm at the end, you know? That's like, ooh, that's cool. I don't know, it's really weird. Yeah, I just uh, got my first dripper actually last week. Um, I've yet to start using it, but uh, I. Uh, got a Igo dripper um so that's that's something that's gonna be new for me I can't wait to try that um I just got a uh steam turbine and a Kraken and a uh uh K-Fun uh over the last months and been building those using those um up until then I was using pro tanks for everything um so I uh you know uh I'm just 
getting into the whole rebuilding thing and not have I haven't even tried the sub ohm. You know, I'm I'm comfortable with building it at 1.2 ohms and it vaping fine. So are you are you getting into the contest on nuclear vandalism, the building contest? Uh, probably not. Did you see mine? <laughs> Did you see mine? I mean, if come you have on. a comedy version of it, I'd be glad to go for oh it. Oh my god! Did you see mine? Oh, you have it to the level of vapor, yeah. honey. And you can you have the whole month as long as they're in by what was it the May thirty first I think it was as long as it, the entries are in yeah. by May thirty first so you have like two weeks to practice. I I will see what I can do. If I can do one that I'm not embarrassed by, <laughs> maybe. You saw my um, build. And you're right. The, once you go K fun, you're done. I, I agree. Uh, uh, vaping out of my K fun is like nothing else I've tried yet. So. And SP asked, what kind of I go did you get? Uh, you know what? I'm not even sure what kind it is. I know it is. I, I believe they say it on them. Mine's an so IGO-W. IGO so it's probably like okay. the low end. The very first one, I think. Yeah. So, um, the main hey. reason I bought it is because it already came built. <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh, That's cheating. I cheat, what can I say? <laughs> um, there actually is a really good vape shop that just opens not too far from me. Um, the guy's been selling his juice online now for a while, and he just opened up a brick and mortar. Um, I don't know if you guys are familiar with uh, Brothers Reserve or not. Um, great juices. If you like, if you like any of the uh, the creams, his Sir Mac is, or the custard. I mean, his Sir Mac is the best custard I've tried yet. Um, but uh, they are very good at helping you learn how to rebuild. You'll take your stuff in there, and they'll sit down with you and explain it and all. And, uh, teach you how to do things. So they, they've been a big help in getting me started with the rebuilding. Oh, awesome. So, and of course That's... it benefits them because then I spend money there. Right. That's where I learned how to rebuild was at my um, local B&M. Ooh. Um, Hold on, I'm trying to reach. That's me. I will definitely get you the address. Um, and yeah, my wife is, will be quick to point out I do spend a lot of time there and a lot of money there, unfortunately, lately. Uh, we all do. <laughs> yeah. Um, part of quitting smoking was to save me money, and somehow that has not worked out. I think once it becomes a hobby, that's where we get in trouble. Yes, absolutely. Because now mine's becoming a hobby because I'm at zero nick. And I believe um, somebody, I want to say it was Princess, asked me, well, what's, somebody asked me, what's the point of vaping if you're at a zero nick? Mine is an oral nice. fixation. I have to have something in my mouth. Hand mouth. And I cannot... Yeah. I have TMJ. So I can't have the gum. I can't have lollipops. I can't have all that stuff. So mine's an oral fixation. And this is the easiest thing. And hell, why not vape? Oh, sorry, princess. It was sis that asked. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> So what, yeah, what mine is the same oh, thing. Sis asked why sis asked, why do I still vape? vape if I'm at a zero nick? Yeah, I'm almost I'm almost down to zero nick now. Um, I started at uh, 36. Wow. Um, wow. Longest time, but I, I want to drop down to zero. I do it for the flavor, and I do it, like you said, the oral fixation, maybe not so much there, but the habit for me, you know, I, I, I just, when I take that break at work, or when I'm sitting on a computer, or whatever, you know, I, it's that habit for me, and, and I think if I quit vaping, smoking's going to creep right back in there, you know. Yep. Think about it, I'm always <laughs> going to be a smoker, it's whether or not I choose to pick up a pack and do it again. Um, the smoking things in my blood, I did it for 30 plus years. I still at times crave having a cigarette. It's just now I have something to supplement that, that I don't cave back onto picking up that cigarette. I think, and God forbid I right. do, because I think my wife would strangle me in my sleep. Yeah, no doubt, right? You'd be divorced real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I think my biggest thing is like in the car. 
I can't stand drivers, and I can't stand idiot drivers. And so, <laughs> see, my biggest thing is in the car. If I didn't, Don't come to PA, then. If I didn't have my... If I didn't have my vape, I would be, yeah, it would not be pretty. It sucks. But anyways. So what's your favorite vape? Excuse me. It's been a long night. What is my favorite vape? Yeah, like, what's your favorite wow. juice? That depends on... That depends on what I've gotten in the mail recently. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I, you know, I belong to Zample Box. I can't sing enough of their praises. I love them. The, the, the variety I get with them is fantastic. Um, so they've turned me on to a lot of vapes that I would have never tried. Um, I just tried one that I just broke open here a little bit ago that I was very curious about. Smelling it, it smells to me like Vicks Vapor Rub, but I just vaped it and oh my god, it is fantastic. Um, I don't know if anybody's familiar with Vape Goddess. Uh, no, I want the bottle though. They have a ginger, ginger <laughs> fetish. It's a ginger. Um, if you like sushi and you get that little slice of ginger with it, it tastes just like that slice of ginger. Um, ah. So yeah, my, my, my taste varied from what I'm vaping at the time. I think my all-time favorite, so I like Alpha Hoops. Um, I really got hooked on the Five Ponds uh, Lucina uh, lately. Um, and another great one that I just tried is uh, People's Vape Cosmonaut. Okay, I uh, that have. Came in my sample box. I yeah, that one came in mine. Yeah. Not so. Huh? Not too impressed. No, you don't like it. I don't. See, I like that. I. I... But then again, it um, could be because I had vapor's tongue for the last like two weeks, uh, and I it tasted like every yeah, other juice. Definitely... That's a very good possibility. Um. Now, Jay, have you tried any Tarot Labs? Tarot Labs, I have not tried yet, no. Oh. Um, there's not too many that I haven't tried. That's probably probably one of the ones that I have not yet, um, as far as the more well-named companies. Uh, definitely looking like, to try that sometime soon. Do uh, you like anise flavors? Anise. Oh, oh, anise. Oh, that's that's actually that would be my all-time favorite flavors. Anything with the anise in it. Then um, you'll like Hermit from Terra Labs. I, that, you know, somebody else told me that. I've I've heard that. Uh, the uh, probably the best anise flavor that I've had lately. Wow, that's that's a toughie. I like Purple Raven from from Mad Cats. Uh, it's, it's anise and grape. Love that that's flavor. What, that's what Rock just got in the mail today for his vape mail, and he's he's vaping that right now. Um, he yeah, wanted love, to know love, if you've I ever tried Granada. Risa was the only one who got no, that. Don't worry about either. Tried. I said. Uh -huh, gigs, yeah. I said something. She or... calls it anise juice. No, I don't. I call anus it anise juice. Oh. Anus juice. Anus juice. <laughs> and she was the only one who caught it. Um, you, have you tried Granada? I'm sorry. No, I haven't. You haven't? Yeah, that's another one Rock can vape all day, every day. There, quite, quite honestly, aside from like menthols and tobaccos, there's not really too many juices that I've had that I didn't like. Um, there's a couple that, okay, I vaped it, That's, that bottle's done, I won't order it again, but I, <laughs> what I found, I found there's more hype to certain juices than, that, than when I get them, I'm like, eh, this isn't all that. It wasn't um, worth it. <laughs> I don't want to, I don't want to be naming names, but there's one that I, one specific that I have right here, I still have, I got this bottle two months ago and I still have probably a quarter to half of the bottle left. And from everybody, I kept hearing this is like the all-time best juice ever, and and <laughs> it's there. It's not horrible, but didn't knock my socks off. <laughs>
Um, you're gonna love that one. Giggle it, vape some anus juice while taking a selfie. Yeah. Really now? That's fair, uh, Eldora. You're something else. So pal. Uh, Where does anybody have any questions for SV or for Jay? <laughs> Oops. Sorry, I was reading the screen and I seen you can SV. Call me whatever you want. Just don't call him late for dinner. I'll call you Jay. Right? Don't call any man late for dinner. You'd be in trouble. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can call me whatever you want. I got an ex-wife. Trust me, I haven't called it before. <laughs> Um, I know there's a little. Uh oh. I just lost feed. Scoot the channel. Scoot the web. Scoot it over. I broke it. Uh oh. Did you break it? We I just went offline. Hold on. We didn't do it. They did it. Stupid Vaughn. They can't hear.